A high-ranking military commander says the Islamic Republic of Iran Air Defense Force will soon operate the domestically designed and manufactured SEPAR over the horizon, off, radar, which is a range of 3,000 kilometers. We are now among the world's top 10 powers in some spheres. We will soon put into operation a homegrown over the horizon, off, radar, Deputy Commander of the Force, Brigadier General Alariza Alhami, told Tehran radio station on Monday, adding, while a number of countries in the world may possess such a radar, less than five states have the technical know-how to locally produce it. He went on to say that SEPAR, Sky, radar will be operational in the near future, noting that it has a range of 3,000 kilometers and will provide the Iran Air Defense Force with the upper hand in operations. The radar can monitor all kinds of aircraft, ranging from commercial airliners, fighter jets and command and control military aircraft to aircraft fitted with radio relay stations and unmanned aerial vehicles, the commander said. It can detect all aerial threats and provide the necessary information for decision-making and countermeasures Ilhami pointed out. The senior Iranian commander also said long-range road mobile and surface-to-air Baver 373, Belief 373, missile system, will come into operation in the near future, adding that the system can detect targets or planes at more than 300 kilometers. Alhami highlighted that Iranian experts are working to upgrade the range of Sayyid, Hunter, tactical surface-to-air missile system and increase it to 120 kilometers. Iranian military experts and technicians have in recent years made substantial headways in manufacturing a broad range of indigenous equipment, making the armed forces self-sufficient in the arms sphere. Iranian officials have repeatedly warned that the country will not hesitate to strengthen its military capabilities, including its missile power, which are entirely meant for defense, saying the Islamic Republic's defense capabilities will be never subject to negotiations. Leader of the Islamic Revolution Ayatollah Sayyid Ali Khamenei has repeatedly called for efforts to maintain and boost Iran's defense capabilities, hitting back at the enemies for disputing the country's missile program. On Thursday, the Iranian armed forces held military parades across the country and in the Persian Gulf waters to mark the Sacred Defense Week. Forces from the Iranian Army, the Islamic Revolution Guards Corps, IRGC, police, border guards, and Basij are participating in the parades. During the parade in Tehran, the Iranian Armed Forces unveiled a surface-to-surface -surface ballistic missile, Resbin, for the first time. Resbin is a liquid-fuel single-stage missile with a detachable warhead that has a range of up to 1,400 kilometers. It can be launched from a variety of fixed and mobile platforms. IRGC Commander Major General Hossein Salami introduced the Resbin missile as the one capable of entering the atmosphere with a speed that is eight times higher than the speed of sound. He noted it is a precision-guided and state-of-the-art missile with a medium ballistic range. During the parades, a missile system, dubbed Kaber Shikan, was also put on display. The missile, which has been previously unveiled, has a range of 1,450 kilometers and enjoys high agility. It is capable of striking its designated targets with pinpoint accuracy. Kaber Shikan is reportedly among third-generation long-range missiles indigenously developed and manufactured by military experts at the IRGC's Aerospace Division. 
it uses solid propellants and is said to be capable of penetrating into missile shields with high maneuverability during its landing stage. The armed forces also showcased another strategic product, a radar system dubbed CUDS. Aerospace Force of the IRGC has also unveiled for the first time a sample of its missiles dubbed 7 e corded in Persian, means the third day of the third month of the Iranian calendar year, with air defense system and 200-kilometer range. Sevami corded air defense system is capable of countering different types of air targets, including helicopters, fighters, drones and cruise missiles. Military officials say the military power of Iran is strong, extraordinary and deterrent, despite enemy sanctions and pressures, and hailed the country's defense sector for its remarkable developments in the recent decades. They stress the Iranian armed forces' deterrent power dissuades the United States and Israel from implementing its threats against the country. The Islamic Republic's military doctrine holds that the country's armed capability solely serves defensive purposes. Iranian military experts and technicians have in recent years made substantial headway in manufacturing a broad range of indigenous equipment, making the armed forces self-sufficient in the weaponry sphere.